Ja und herzlich willkommen zurück zu The Invincible. Ähm, ich habe ein bisschen drum geschaut. Ich konnte nichts finden. Ich habe bei den Einstellungen, die bei der Barrierefreiheit ähm, habe ich die Hinweise eingeschaltet, sodass man sie ein bisschen sieht. Und das ist echt ein bisschen beschissen. Wenn man hier weggeht, steht dort hinten endlich. Okay. Und auch das hier sieht man, kann man verwenden. Hier ist ein Sauerstofftank. Der unten rechts gar nicht angezeigt wird, dass man ihn verwenden könnte. Erst jetzt. Man muss genau drauf schauen. Also ja. Ich bin ein bisschen doof. Ich lasse jetzt das mal so an. Möchte ich zwar nicht, aber offensichtlich bin ich irgendwie blind. Aber gut. Ich nehme jetzt mal den Sauerstofftank. Ja, nehme ihn besser mit. Starten den Rover. Jetzt können wir ihn endlich starten. Ist ein bisschen lächerlich, wenn man mich fragt. So, vielleicht die Tür zu tun oder nicht? Ich lasse jetzt mal die Hinweise an. Ha! The engine started. Then what are you waiting for? Leave this cursed place. Willst du nicht die Tür zu tun? Are you driving? Verlasse die Stadt. I'm going. Please talk to me. And maybe that will calm me down. Nice. Oh shit! It hit the bonnet! Don't worry. Even if it hits the rover directly, you'll come out unscathed. Yeah, the vehicle is, is kind of a Faraday cage. The, the energy will flow through the body, discharge it to the ground. I know I asked you to talk to me, but I don't need a lecture in physics right now. Then what? Some peace and quiet would actually be better. Ja, das finde ich gerade ziemlich cool, weil ich steuere den Rover wirklich selber. Ich gebe Gas und ich kann lenken. Das ist ziemlich cool ist in so einem Walking Simulator mäßigen Spiel. Und ich bewege mich im Kreis. Ähm. Sehe ja gar nichts. Okay. Was für ein Sturm. Ich frag mich, wer hat diesen Rover hier zurück zurückgelassen? Und warum? Ehrlich gesagt hat es ein bisschen, schon ein bisschen Horroratmosphäre. Das wollte ich eigentlich nicht unbedingt bei diesem Spiel haben, wenn ich ehrlich bin. Aber gut. Hier lang, hier lang. Da 
Damn it. I'm having trouble finding the right way. You've got to head southwest. How am I supposed to know where southwest is? I don't have a compass, remember? The city attracts lightning, so the fewer flashes on the horizon, the better. Uh, how far am I from the city's border? Uh, considering how fast you're moving, if you're heading straight to the destination, as long as no structures collapse... You don't know, do you? It's not that simple. There are too many unknown variables. No, no, no. So that's the feeder in Kreis. Status? How are you doing, Yasna? I'm still alive. The signal's just weak. Unfortunately, yes. But it's hardly surprising. Oh shit! Was stand da hier, bin ich durchgegangen? I'm running into a cave. The storm has subsided. Ist das richtig? Will ich in eine Höhle fahren? Ich weiß ja nicht. Am Schluss stecke ich hier noch fest. Ich glaube, ich, man kann nicht wirklich was falsch machen. Okay, abgesehen davon komme ich da jetzt nicht mehr hoch. Dann war es wahrscheinlich doch der richtige Weg. Dann geht es halt in die Höhle hinein. Wenigstens hat das Teil mal ein bisschen Licht. Formation. Even better. You have to catch your breath eventually. Can I ask for one thing? Could you find the model number of the rover? <sighs> what for? I've got an idea, but it depends on the model. Uh, Emmett 2001. Could that be it? Uh, let me see. Emmets are equipped with a black box. Please find it. I have the box, but it's all locked up. Really? Uh, they must have changed the equipment because I have no information about a key. Where did you even get a catalogue of their gear from, sir? And anyway, it doesn't matter. What should I do? One second. I don't know if this can help, but the Alliance labels black boxes as data loggers. Eureka! Cable access. Look for something resembling a socket, a plug. I think I have something like that. Then you can connect to the probe's brain there. And uh, presto. It won't work. These inputs are not compatible with Commonwealth plugs. From the outside, our equipment is different, but inside we have the same guts, so to speak. Cable on the back of the box should already fit. Same guts, hey? Just like with humans. Wenn's an dem scheitert, dass es ein UK Plug ist. Okay, it's in. Just a moment. Well done, Doctor. I'm receiving a signal. So, what now? You can finally rest. It'll take me a while to dig through all the records. Alliance Heroes. The rover was connected to a base. The one from the slides? Huh? 
Uh, most probably. Hmm. No one is transmitting from the base. On the other channels, all I hear is static. The storm must be causing interference. Komm ich schon mit bei 1 leuchtet das Punktgerät. I suggest you lie down. The storm is raging. It may not be that simple. I'm too tired to sleep. Yeah, I know that paradox all too well. Can I help you somehow? We talk. Maybe I'll finally fall asleep. Naturally. Have anything specific in mind? Yes, actually. I wasn't able to report it earlier. But I found fossils underground. Fossils? Based on my brief observations, they belong to lizard-like creatures. Really? I'm amazed that something lived on this sterile rock. Please forgive the question, but are you sure? Well, I didn't imagine them, did I? I don't know. It felt real. Why don't I try to find some confirmation in the Alliance data? For now, let's talk about something else. Instead of getting ahead of ourselves. A more light-hearted subject, perhaps. May I ask why you became an astronaut? There are two answers to this question. An honest one? And a personal lie. To give you the clearest picture of the truth, I'd have to tell you both. I'm all is. As cadets, we participated in a series of meetings. HQ organized them to encourage potential recruits. We all said the same thing, just a little different. We all wanted to push the boundaries of human potential, discover what is undiscovered. Remembering childhood memories when we first heard about that brave forces of the Commonwealth. Sometimes these speeches were already being prepared during the training, if you understand what I mean. Every astronaut wished to explore space. They had to wish that. But my reason, an honest reason, not a nice sounding memory that never happened. I've never been able to find my place. So I came to the conclusion that I would not find it anywhere except out here, in space. Although I never dreamed of exploring. Such lofty ideas as expanding human limits were of little interest to me. It was among my crew that I... Not good. Don't get a break. What is it this time? Oh, wait. Astrogator, can you explain to me what I'm hearing right now? This is a recording from the rover. The Alliance has apparently broken the encryption of our radio channel. Oh, bollocks. So, so what do we do? We need to change the frequency and encryption key. What's the point? As soon as you give me a new channel, they will overhear us and change it as well. Just look at the probe's brain. Luna? What's with... All you have to do is watch it closely. I'm switching now. Waiting for you to join. Oh, I see. The new frequency is... Okay, the channel is active. Now the encryption key. The first three digits of the cipher are... Did I just flash this dark? Next is... Nothing. Dead silence. I have to try again. The first three digits of the cipher are... Drei, zwei, sieben. Uh, the next is... Ich wollte es nochmal ausprobieren. 
2, 1, 4. Oh, I'm here. Well done. I should buy us some time. So, how should we continue? Uh, don't you need more time to rest? I do. But there's no way I'm going to sleep now. Besides, nothing's stopping me anymore. The storm has subsided. All right. Let's not risk evacuating directly from the city. It should be safer outside its perimeter. I took the liberty of looking through the photos of the nearby area. Everything north and east of your location looks relatively safe. So? Should I go back to the ship? That's an odd question. Of course you should come back. Now even more than ever. Very concerned for your safety, Doctor. Uh, no need to be. I'm fine. Verlasse die Stadt. Alright, schön, dass es wieder Tag ist und hell. Finde ich schon mal viel besser. Astrogator, I think I've gone far enough. There is a vast open area in front of me. Astrogator, the city is no longer visible. We need to decide what to do next. Dragonfly, over. Are you there? Yes, yes, please excuse me. I was in the infirmary. Is the coast clear? Yep, all clear. Good. Give me a moment. I'm looking at the satellite images. Hm. Have you examined Marit's body yet? I wired her brain to a grave tapper, if that's what you're asking. Yes, that's what I meant. Have you watched the memory recording? Yes, but I didn't say anything because the picture is ambiguous. To put it mildly, a lot of black dots. The graininess of the image is extremely bad. All right, I've got it. Sector AZ-25... Let's say AZ-2504. Please check if it's fit to land. So. Müssen sowieso nach draußen. <laughs> Sieht unglaublich cool aus hier. Like I said, it looks good. Clear opening, flat terrain. Excellent. Please go there while I prepare the lander. I'll just pack Artie inside. So that's it. You're taking me to the dragonfly. We're flying away from here for good. We have no other choice, Doctor. At this stage of the mission, we can only minimize losses. You understand that, don't you? Yes, sir? Are you sure that's all we can do? Could we... Don't you even think about it. About what? You didn't let me finish, sir. Uh, but I know what might be on your mind. Going back for Gorski's body, contacting the Alliance, or continuing research on your own. These are not possibilities. A certain death. Please remember, we have just one lander left. As a commander, I must first ensure your safe return. Only then I'll send Artie with other tasks. Here are Spuren. Okay. Now I must decide. Straße zur Landezone. Und die Straße zur Allianz. Was ist unsere Option? Hm. Ich würde sagen, wir überlegen uns das in der nächsten Folge von den Winzable. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss.